Welcome back. Continuing our effort to give you as much election information as possible before you head to the polls. Today we bring you two candidates running for the Baton Rouge City Constable position. Anna Conejo speaks to both and has more on what they hope to bring to the table. Two women running for the Baton Rouge City Constable position. This is Terika Williams, who has been in office since 2019 who broke barriers by becoming the first female city constable in the history of the agency. Now she's seeking re-election. When I decided to run for this position in 2018, it was because I had a passion for law enforcement. I had a passion for my community and to be able to help my community grow. Running against Williams is Louisiana State Representative C. Denise Marcel. I want to go to the constable's office and make the constable's office the best that it could be. Meanwhile, Williams says during her time in office, she has made much needed improvements and upgrades such as. I've been able to invest in new equipment such as tasers, um, laptops, weapons, brand new units, um, just everything that the officers needed, even getting the officers an 11% pay increase. If elected for the position, Marcel says she plans to bring her experience from serving in the city council and as a state rep. She would like to bring more funding to the office. I currently serve on the appropriations committee, so that's the money committee. And I've, I've had those relationships and certainly uh, know where the pots of monies are for a lot of the law enforcement issues. In relation to knowledge and experience, both say they are fully equipped for the role. I started my career at the, at the sheriff's office. I started in uh, communications, courtroom security. I worked at parish prison. I also attended the 162nd Basic Training Academy. So I have the training, I have the knowledge, and I have the experience because I have worked in the constable's office. I went to work for Major Brown in criminal processing in the sheriff's office, and I left, went back to the legal field, and then I uh, was called back by him to work in the constable's office. So for me, it's um, a full turn of events. Uh, I've done policy making. I've been an advocate. Uh, I've done a lot of things on the council, state rep. And now I'm just going to return back uh, to what I started in. Early voting runs from October 18th to the 29th. Election day is November 5th. For your election headquarters, I'm Ana Conejo.